everybody, Sebastian here, and in this YouTube video, I am going to be doing a biking video. I'm on my bike again, alright, on the Belgian coast, and yeah, I'm gonna film a bit on cut for you, like that you see how the roads are, okay, so let's do it. So basically, yeah, I decided, you know what, I'm coming back to the Belgian coast because I was like miserable at home without my bike. I was miserable. So yeah, I'm very glad I have my bike again. And yeah, let's just ride. I'll show you a bit how it looks like. Here, the bike pits are very, very good, like, yeah, great. And it's just great, like, waking up ah, in the fresh air, early in the morning, and go for a bike ride. It's just great. And like, people have one of these excuses riding the bike, like, Oh, I can't go riding the bike. I don't have the perfect equipment. <laughs> okay, me, do I have the perfect equipment? No. Okay. I don't, I, this time I don't even have a helmet. And then people have these excuses, Oh, I can't go riding the bike. Cause it's gonna, um, it's gonna rain soon. And it's not like beautiful weather. But like, really check this out, like. Does this look like, does it look like it's gonna rain? Perhaps. Yeah, I'm still riding my bike. I already did like freaking 20 kilometers just now. Okay, 20. And I'm about to do like 80 today. Even though when it's this weather. Okay? Like, oh, when you really eliminate all of the excuses, like, you really have no excuse why you shouldn't ride a bike, you know? Just eliminate all of the excuses and just go do it. It's like, that's the simplest. There's no one here. The hell did that me? Like, what the hell? <laughs> so yeah, now it's raining, and I'm still riding my bike. You see, you can't give up. You cannot give up. When you go to achieve, want to achieve big things in life, you need to be a lion. A lion. Not a snail, a lion. And put yourself in the discomfort. Yeah. T-shirt, shorts, and uh... Wayne. But the thing is, why am I capable of doing this here? Like, look, it's a bit waning and I still ride my bike. Why am I capable of doing it? It's because I set my morning routine to, to like, to achieve this here, you know? So basically what I did is, I 
I did a morning with you, which other called shower. And this cold shower prepared me for any obstacle that's thrown my way today. I put my brain on my side, and since there's something, the brain's on my side, it's like I get to control every aspect what my brain says and wants to, you know. I'm on the west side. I need to cross here. I don't have the best like knapsack today, but like it's a proof. Even though you have a knapsack like this here, you know, you can still get pretty full. It's green for me. Okay, let's continue. Let's continue the bike wide. Oh yeah. Don't forget, it's like, while you're watching this here, it's like, you're just seeing me bike, you know, like, uh, this is normal speed, this is how Oli always is doing. But don't forget, I'm here filming, only holding one hand on the thing, you know. So it's like, yeah, I don't have the best camera quality, I'm, I'm sorry, it's like, it's just like a spontaneous video I decided to film from my iPhone 5C, so, yeah, I apologize if it's not the best, you know. But yeah, I want to show you a bit how it looks like, see, like the bike pits here are very nice. You see, and I can tell you a biking tip, you see, look, in order to achieve long distances, you want to have the bike work for you, okay? Lots of people, when they go biking, they're like, they're like, yeah, all the time, like, pedaling, pedaling really fast on the wrong gear, and then they get extremely tired, but you want to have the bike work for you, okay? What does that mean? Right now, the bike is working for me, you see. I'm not pedaling, yet I'm getting extremely full. You see? That's the secret to, to achieve long distance. You see, look. I pedal. Okay, you get a bit. You accelerate a bit. And you let go. Boom. The bike is working for you. You see? So it's like... You, you save energy and get further, you see, with less amount of work. It's about, biking is like, about working smart, okay? You want to be smart, okay? And I have this goal in mind, like, I'm reaching Knock today, which is 80 kilometers in total. And it's like, when you have a goal like this here, you want to fuck any voice. Fuck any voice that says you can, okay? Like, just like, imagine like, you know, you hear that little voice, oh, you can't do it, don't do it, don't do it. You want to fuck that voice and just go and do it anyway, you know, just go and do it anyway.
because it's like us humans it's like we we as humans we just want to like be comfortable you know stay in bed a little while it's like that's the place where no epic things happen you know it's like you know you want to step into epicness get a bit bit discomfort get inspired for me go on adventures go bike ride even though when it's like this here it's like get a bit discomfort you know Cause like, yeah, it's like, we only live once, you know, we only live once. And like, had I stayed in bed all day long, like, I would have missed this here. And the bike is such, it's such a beautiful sport. It's such a beautiful sport. It's just amazing. like. I prefer biking over ping pong. Like I like driving stuff. Like I like driving cars. I like driving bikes. I like driving planes. I like moving from one destination to another. I like traveling, walking around the cities, walking in general outside, exploring new places. Just I love it so much, you know. So so much. But obviously, like, while you bike, you do want to be careful of, like, you know, like, other people not following the road rules, you know? Like, you might be an extremely safe bike driver, yet someone might, a kid might cross the road, or an old guy might cross the road when you're not allowed to. So it's like, you know, it's something you really need to be careful of, you know? Which was a bit scary last time because, like, last time when I was biking, it's like this what this guy, this old guy, crossed the road when it was wet and I had green, and it's like it scared me because, like, you know, I really could have hit him, you know. This how it looks like. See this traffic behind me. See it's wet. So, yeah, it's extremely important to follow the signs of the world. Think something. Green, you see, so... Now that it's green, it's like, the chance of me getting hit is like, always zero percent. Like, you see, because they have wet. See? Like... Yeah, safety is very important. So you might be wondering, why don't I have, why didn't I put on my helmet today? It's because I brought it home with me when I left the bedroom course last time. So this time, it's like, there were some helmets, but they're discomfort, not, not comfortable, you know? So I decided, like, fuck it. <laughs> I'm just wearing a helmet. And it is a bad example, like, do not follow my example. We're not wearing the head. So help me, okay? Don't. Okay. <laughs> because like I don't want you to get hurt, you know. Like a helmet does save your life if a car hits you. Like if a car hits me today, I'm gone. I'm gone forever. You know, like my life can end today. My life can end. Any second I'm on the bike, just takes one car to hit me and I'm gone. And I'm fucking gone. There'll be no more YouTube videos up. Not even, if I die right now, this YouTube video won't even be up. <laughs> <laughs> but generally, like, I'm like, I am actually like medium speed on this bike, you know. Like, I do pass lots of people and stuff. Now I'm, now I'm like, 
like him more with two hands, like you can see more the actual speed of how I bike when I'm off camera. So it's like, here there are times like, okay, you can go faster, you know, there's no one. Alright, look ahead. biking in front of me or past them. Unfortunately I do not have a, a bell on the bike which is pretty annoying because like I can't I have to slow down a bit and then it, it like becomes awkward because I can't pass them you know and I want to. Now since it's slowing down I'm gonna go from seventh to fifth she was slowing down. And it's all natural, you see. Look what we did. I apologize because I had no more space, like, on my, um, a GSM. There was a 25 video I wanted to upload. It was, like, expressing how I feel, but it's, like, I decided i just delete that video, make this video fully uncut for you guys, so, yeah. Alright. So, like, now it's weird time to start. So, basically, um, you might be wondering... Why do I pass others? Like, why why do I pass others so effortlessly without getting tired? Okay. And the reason for that is because, see, they, those people, for example, they're more like biking for relaxation, you know. They don't have like an end goal, you know. Like, they're just like, Stick around the area, you know, go from one beach to another, you know. But me, it's like I have a really full goal, which is 80 kilometers, you know. So it's like, therefore, it's like, you know, I'm focusing really on it and I will pass them if they you know, I have to go on the road because you see all of these roads now. Oh, coming now I'm on the road. And the acceleration. 26 miles an hour. Has to be careful. It's always scary riding on the road, you know. And there's a, there's a car behind. Gosh. That's always so scary. Okay, so now, for example, my heart being a bit faster, you see? So, I need a bit of wet, so now I'll put it down to fourth gear. This is my last me. You have to 
get to it, I'm again. You see where you feel hot? It's pumping too fast. Okay. Relax a bit like that. Take some deep breaths. See, relax a bit, you see. Look, even though I'm still relaxing, since I'm working small, the bike is going for me, you see. Okay, now we can continue. I didn't like bike the way like <laughs> 30 kilometers. <laughs> it's nothing. 30 kilometers is nothing. It's nothing. Not even. I didn't even do like half yet. <laughs> and I'm still so, so awake full of energy. <laughs> See, now I'm managing coming back and I'm starting to better fast and now we sip ski again. Up, up to. See, bang. See, but no one. No one speed. Not tired. It's like when you arrive to your goal and like you look back like you're like holy shit I already did all of that <laughs> you know like it's an it's a very very amazing <sighs> marathon now let's go fast yeah Ooh, buddy yeah Oh my gosh, I'm crazy. Now we have to slow down a bit. Yeah. <sighs> okay, now I set gear down.
going to say to pass them. So yeah. Here we go. No one. Right, I think my tie is getting low, so I'm gonna end my video here. So if you enjoyed my video, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, share if you enjoyed, and peace out.